Jordan. Jordan. I need you to send the boxes in my office to, to this address, please. This one right here. This address right here, okay? Can you do that? Uh, yes, Good. sure. All right, thank you. Mistake. Yes. What? What? Hey. Andrew. Why, why are you panting? Because I've been running. Really, from Alaska? I need to talk to you. Yeah, well, I don't have time to talk. I need to catch a 545 to Toronto. Margaret. So I need the boxes to go out today. I want to make sure everything is safe. Margaret, Parker. stop talking! Oh. Gotta say something. Okay. So just take a sec. Fine. What? Three days ago. I loathed you. I used to dream about you getting hit by a cab or poisoned. Oh, that's, that's nice. That's yeah, I told you to stop talking. Then we had our little adventure up in Alaska, and things started to change. Things changed when we kissed. And when you told me about your tattoo. Even when you checked me out when we were naked. Me? <laughs> I didn't see anything. Yeah, you did. But I didn't realize any of this until I was standing alone in a barn, wifeless. Now, you can imagine my disappointment when it suddenly dawned on me that the woman I love is about to be kicked out of the country. So, Margaret, marry me. I'd like to date you. Trust me. You don't really want to be with me. Yes, I do. See, the thing is, there is a reason why I've been alone all this time. I'm comfortable that way. I think it would just be a lot easier if we forgot everything that happened and I just left. You're right. That would be easier. Andrew! 